Hello everyone. Welcome to Agriculture Insight. Did you know that the world harvests up to 9.2 million tons of strawberries every year? And notably, the United States proudly stands as one of the leading contributors playing a significant role in this impressive production of delicious strawberries. These sweet and juicy fruits are favored across the nation, cherished for their flavor and versatility in everything from fresh desserts to jams and smoothies. In today's journey we're exploring the captivating world of strawberries, from the sprawling fields of California, where they're carefully hand-picked, to the modern factories where strawberries are processed into America's most popular products, such as frozen strawberries and premium strawberry jam. Let's explore with me now. Every strawberry's journey begins in sprawling fields. In California, which supplies an impressive 90% of the U.S. strawberry production, the total strawberry acreage spans 37,000 acres, with two-thirds of it concentrated in the Santa Maria area. Strawberries here are harvested almost year-round, becoming ready for picking about 70 days after planting. Hand-picking is the traditional method of harvesting strawberries in California, where the majority of the workforce on these vast fields is made up of Mexican laborers. After watching the harvesting process, would you like to go directly to the gardens to pick the red strawberries? Have you ever noticed that farmers often run really fast after harvesting strawberries? If you know why, drop a comment and let me know. Each year, around 55,000 workers take up jobs on California's strawberry farms. Earning an average of $15 to $20 per hour, they work tirelessly under the blazing sun, carefully moving row by row picking only the ripest, reddest strawberries. These skilled hands not only recognize the perfect ripeness of each berry, but also handle them delicately, placing them into harvest boxes nearby to prevent bruising or damage. This job demands patience and precision, as strawberries are incredibly fragile. Once the harvest boxes are filled to the brim, they are immediately transported to packaging facilities, ensuring maximum freshness before reaching consumers. While the work of harvesting strawberries is undeniably tough, it also provides job opportunities for thousands of immigrant workers who have become the heart and soul of California's renowned strawberry industry. These boxes of strawberries can be shipped directly to consumers without any further processing steps. Alongside being packaged fresh for direct sale, many strawberries are destined to become frozen delights, ensuring their flavor and quality are preserved for longer. At the factory, strawberries are carefully unloaded onto conveyor belts, where they move to automated cutting machines that remove their green caps. This cutting system precisely trims the caps without damaging the fruit, ensuring the flesh remains intact. This efficient process not only speeds up production, but also ensures each strawberry is uniformly prepared for the next stage. Once the green caps are removed, the strawberries undergo a thorough washing process to ensure they are completely clean and free from any impurities. This is achieved through a combination of high-pressure spray nozzles and large immersion tanks, which work together to remove dirt, debris, and any potential residues from the fruit. The high-pressure spray nozzles gently rinse the strawberries while the immersion tanks provide a deep cleanse, allowing even the tiniest particles to be washed away. Once cleaned, the strawberries move along the conveyor for hand sorting. Skilled workers meticulously inspect each berry, removing any that don't meet the strict quality standards. This step ensures only the best strawberries move forward in the process. Next, the selected strawberries move on to the quick freezing stage, where they are exposed to extremely low temperatures of 9 to 20 degrees Fahrenheit. 
This rapid freezing process works by quickly lowering the temperature of the fruit, preventing the formation of large ice crystals that could damage the cell structure. The freezing process typically takes about 2 to 10 minutes. The strawberries are gently shaken or jostled on the conveyor belt to ensure they don't stick together, allowing for an even freeze and maintaining their quality. The strawberries are funneled into a sizing station where they are sorted by size. The conveyor system includes precisely spaced slots that allow strawberries of specific dimensions to drop through, ensuring consistency in the final product. A final round of hand sorting takes place to double-check quality and ensure no imperfections are missed. Finally, the sorted and frozen strawberries are packed into cartons lined with protective plastic bags. The cartons are then carefully sealed to protect the products inside, ensuring the freshness and quality of the frozen strawberries. These cartons are then stacked onto pallets, ready for transport. With every step designed to maximize freshness and quality, these frozen strawberries are prepared to bring a taste of summer to consumers year-round. Next, we head to the Strawberry Jam Factory. At the Jam Factory, large bags of frozen strawberries are emptied out to begin the jam-making process. Frozen strawberries are used because they retain their freshness and natural flavor thanks to the quick freezing process. This ensures that the strawberry jam is delicious, visually appealing, and of high quality. Next, the strawberries are transported to the cooking area, where they are poured into large industrial cooking kettles. These kettles are designed to handle high volumes of strawberries while maintaining consistent heat for even cooking. Once inside, the strawberries are combined with carefully measured amounts of sugar and other ingredients such as natural pectin or lemon juice, depending on the desired texture and flavor profile. During cooking, the mixture is gently stirred to prevent burning and to maintain the vibrant red color of the strawberries. This step is critical to producing a jam that not only tastes delicious, but also has an appealing texture and consistency. The controlled process ensures every batch meets high quality standards, delivering the same delightful taste every time. After about 30 minutes of cooking, the strawberry jam reaches perfection and is ready to be transferred to the jar filling area. The jar filling process for strawberry jam on an automated conveyor system is a seamless and efficient operation. At the filling station, precise nozzles dispense the cooked strawberry jam into each jar. The system is designed to control the exact quantity poured into each jar, ensuring uniformity across the batch. The jam still warm flows smoothly into the jars, filling them up to the required level. After the jars are filled with warm strawberry jam, they move to the capping station on the conveyor belt. Here, sterilized lids are automatically placed onto each jar with precision. Advanced machinery then securely seals the lids, creating an airtight closure that preserves the jam's freshness and flavor. After sealing, the jars of strawberry jam are sprayed with water to quickly cool them down, stabilizing the internal temperature and preventing condensation inside the jars. After the jars are securely sealed, they move to the labeling station. Automated systems apply labels with product information, ensuring accuracy and consistency. The labeled jars are then packed into large boxes, ready for transportation and distribution to reach consumers. Now that we've followed the journey of the strawberry from field to table, you might wonder, how do farmers nurture these berries from seedling to fruit? Let's dive in. Strawberry fields in California begin with thorough plowing and tilling to loosen the soil, improve aeration, and prepare it for planting. Next, raised beds are carefully shaped to create an ideal environment for strawberry plants, ensuring proper drainage and healthy root development. The raised beds are then covered with plastic mulch to retain soil moisture, control weeds, and regulate soil temperature. Semi-automatic planting machines are used to efficiently plant strawberry seedlings, placing them at consistent depths and spacing for optimal growth. After planting, sprinkler or rotary irrigation systems are employed to evenly water the strawberry fields, 
ensuring every plant receives adequate moisture while minimizing water waste. Automatic fertilizer spreaders are then used to evenly distribute nutrients across the field, providing the plants with the essential elements needed for healthy growth and high yields. And that's how a thriving strawberry field is cultivated in California. In Europe, greenhouse growing is more common than farm growing. The process begins by harvesting strawberry runners from open fields, carefully selecting healthy, disease-free plants. The harvested runners are then transported to a sorting facility, where workers carefully sort and select the best quality runners for planting. Next, the selected runners are transferred to tray fields, where they are planted in specially designed trays filled with nutrient-rich substrate. These trays ensure optimal root development and plant health. Once filled, the trays are carefully arranged in the field. This setup provides the ideal conditions for the young strawberry plants to establish strong roots before being moved to the greenhouse. Afterward, the strawberry runners are meticulously placed into the trays by skilled farmers. Each runner is positioned with care to ensure proper root contact with the nutrient-rich substrate. This precise process helps maximize the plant's growth potential and prepares them for the next stages of cultivation. After approximately two to three months of care in the tray fields, the strawberry plants are mature enough to be transplanted into the greenhouse. Farmers carefully harvest the trays of strawberry plants and transport them to the greenhouse for the next stage of cultivation. Once inside the greenhouses, the strawberry plants are carefully transplanted into their growing systems, which are designed to provide optimal conditions for growth. Soon after, these flowers transform into plump, juicy strawberries, ripening to a vibrant red, ready for harvest. The process of harvesting strawberries in a greenhouse is exactly the same as harvesting in the field. After harvesting, the strawberries are carefully packed into containers to preserve their freshness during transport. They are then quickly transported to a nearby packing facility, where workers sort and pack the berries according to size and quality standards. The packaging process ensures the strawberries are protected from damage and maintain their peak flavor and appearance. Our journey of strawberry ends here. Please like, follow the channel, and join us in the next videos.